So we're going to open up a Palafin box. Now the Palafin box has three beautiful promos in it. And I will show you guys the promos. Okay, Dami. Well, we'll see you when you get back, my friend. You get three beautiful promos, which I got to say, the Palafin looks cool. It sparkles really well. Look at that sparkle. Ooh, pretty. Then you get two Cosmo cards. This is my favorite from these three promos. Cosmo Finizen. I just have a love for Finizen as a Pokemon. Really cool card. And then you get uh cosmo palafin which is a great artwork as well it's the one with the zero uh, hero ability which you need to evolve into palafin ex so you got all three of these beautiful cards it would still be cool to pull that sir i think i just seen something shine back there didn't get to see what it was but let's see i think we got our first hit of your boxes and you could tell right now it's pink oh is this the set with Prime Catcher? I think Temporal Forces has Prime Catcher. Let's hit that Prime Catcher. Ooh, Reboot Pod. This is actually pretty good. Attach a basic energy card from your discard pile to each of your future Pokemon. If Future Box ever becomes a very viable deck, this could actually become a very playable card. But I would love, because we're going to be opening up for both Brook and for Shadow Killer. I would love to hit something big for both. Oh, we got Luxio. Okay. Come on. But Fable. At least we got an EX, it looks like. Let's see what it is. Is it going to be something good? Hey, another Scream Tell. That's nice. Maybe Obsidian Flames. Actually, the last two streams that featured Obsidian Flames has given us luck. Because I pulled Rever Room EX. Uh in the previous stream and then the stream before that i pulled pidgeot ex so every time i've opened up on stream this set has given us fire and it's about to give us fire once again i don't know which card this is but it is an ir brooke you got any guesses on what ir that could be oh it looks like we're gonna have a double banger pack any guesses on uh, what the ir could be in this set in this pack right now Let's see. Oh, that is so awesome because they just recently announced that a Houndoom IR is coming out, I think, in Shrouded Fable. So the Houndour IR is a beautiful card to pull. Really nice. And then the Decidueye as well. Double banger. I actually think I've I've enjoyed opening up Obsidian Flames a lot too. I still think Paldea Evolved takes it for me just because it has the Skeledurge SIR and that's like my favorite SIR. And then it has Baby Foy Coco. So I think that one takes it for me just because of what's in the set. But I think when it comes to fun opening, I gotta agree, Obsidian Flames sits up there high. Fezendipity. Hey, at least we got something back here. We got one more hit from this box, so it's going to be a three-hitter. Ooh, Wellspring Mask Ogre Pond. He used starters from different generations. So that could still be the case for uh, Legend ZA. But if they use the uh, starters, we're probably going to see uh, Delphox, Chestnut, and what is their water? Is that the one with Greninja? I think that's Greninja's era, which... Greninja's already gotten it. So it's like, would they give it to Greninja again? <laughs> Come on. Damn it, Scyther. Hey, we got Incineroar, though. We were just talking about starters. All right. I'm just going to go in the order that the stack came out of. And let's see if we can get something groovy. But yeah, Shadow Killer. I'm really feeling like I'm going to be hooking you up today because... I know you normally join in on the breaks, and I am not too pleased with those packs. But we got Drake Cloak. That's pretty cool. Reverse. Hey, that is a good hit. There we go. So, Brooke, it looks like uh, we're going to be hitting some fire. Nice. And then the Tillmass Ogre Pond. Uh, you know what, Infernape? You've got to get your own sleeve. That is nice. All right, 
Temporal Forces, you have yet to give us anything major today. It is time to change that. We're going to be opening up five more of these boxes today. We got That means we got five more Temporal Forces packs. Temporal Forces, you can step up and give us something big. Obsidian Flames has done it already with that Hound Hour. So there's no excuses. That you can't do something like that. There you go. See, I, I have the voice of reason here. I'm over here convincing the pack to give us a pool. That is a stunning card, by the way. It is just a vibe. It is absolutely a vibe. That is an awesome, awesome card. You get to be first pack. You showed us some love, and I appreciate it. So, Temporal Forces, can we do it again? Can we make a repeat? I'm not trying to be greedy. I would just love to pull uh, my pal Brooke. Something nice. Hey, hey I, I, I think I am the Pack Whisperer, guys. I think I am the Pack Whisperer. Because I know y'all see that, right? I know y'all see this, right? Let's see. A hero's cape. That's pretty nice. Followed by the Haunter Reverse. And a Mel Metal. Did I grab the energy? No, I did not. All right. Twilight Masquerade. Let's get another hit. Pincer. Come on. Let's see Sparkle. Just a Litwick. Hey, that's good. There we go. Oh, nice. That's a good one. So that's the set I just opened up just now and got the Palafin from. It's the set with Charizards as the chase cards. But it does have Umbreon as well as a reverse Umbreon that is really hard to pull. Hey, another Wellspring mask. That's nice. Let's do this. Let's do this. That is some last pack magic, baby. That is some last pack magic from Ascidian Flames. That is some last pack magic. What do y'all think it is? What do y'all think we got here? It is indeed some last pack magic. So, what do y'all think? It is a Pidgeot EX SIR, which that is beautifully centered. Nice. That is a way to end. Uh, I told y'all though, did I not tell y'all that uh, <laughs> that Obsidian Flames comes in clutch? Did I not tell y'all that? But if you would ever like me to just hold on and create, it, I, I guess streamers call them bags. I could do that for you too. Okay. Chansey. Polyrath. This is the third Blissey today. What is the deal with Blissey and Blissey just showing up? I love Blissey. She's beautiful, but come on, Blissey. Like reactivating it because they've been sending me like 50% off coupons. And I could spend like 200 and something dollars and have the site for three more years. But I'm not 100% sure. But on Twitter, if you would like to join in on Twitter, um, I will give you, uh, I will post on Twitter when I have breaks available. Hey, Iron Crown. Hey, nice. 